My husband loves uh, baking bread and he has developed this uh, craft of sourdough baking and um, we are at a point in our lives where we would like to have him ho stay home as opposed to uh, leaving town to work for films. So we thought uh, with everything that was going on in the community, it would be a great time. We figured to support that part of the business because we weren't sure how everything was gonna go, um, that we would add in a bed and breakfast. Um, we are already renting the space to a lot of directors and film people, film crew, and so we figured we could just fill in the gap that way. It's just part of the city that we really wanted to open up sort of a safe space just to bring more community environment to it and uh, open up the neighborhood, open up the downtown, bring everybody up a block maybe. It just it caught our eye when it was on the market about three and a half years ago and um, we just jumped on the opportunity. The downtown has been fantastic. Um, Anna Peg, Shabby, Stones and Sweet Greetings specifically have really sent so many people here. It's been really great. Um, the market, we did uh, the mill market a couple of times before we opened and the people like ran here the first Saturday we were open. It was pretty amazing. And I think just from, like you said, social media and word of mouth, it's just been growing and growing. Lots of interest in the bread originally, but now it's we're starting to fill up our takeout fridge. And so the curries are really becoming popular and uh, we have dips to go with the breads and things. So our goal is to have um, a full takeout fridge with meals, like prepared meals to go. We, uh, everything's from scratch and I think people realize that. They, they taste it, they see it, and it's always all butter. You know, we don't shy away from butter and sugar. <laughs>